Hey everyone, this is a short presentation of the iPad theme for Windows 7. So, what's included in the iPad theme? There are the iPad icons. Each of the icons is uh, linked to a web application. So, if I click here, for example, on Mail, it will open up Hotmail. Or if I click on Maps, it will open up Bing Maps. Um, you can, of course, change the web application. Um, I will show you how to do that a little bit later. So what else is there? There's the official iPad wallpaper in the background, and there's the iPad dock. Um, if any of these icons is missing, you have to know how to clear the icon cage. So next up is a short guide how to clear the icon cage in Windows 7. How to clear the icon cage in Windows 7. First of all, start your Windows Explorer. You can either do that by clicking on the Explorer icon on your taskbar, or by holding down Windows key and E. Next go to C, um, Users, then click on your username, open up App Data, go to Local, scroll down, and there you will find the file iconcage.db. You can rename or delete the file all along. I will rename it to iconcage2.db and then you have to either reboot or simply restart your explorer. I will start the explorer exe. Yes, and process. Then simply click on file, new task, run and the explorer exe. And then you will have cleared the icon cache in Windows 7. Next up, we are going to change some of the web services of the iPad theme. So let's say you don't like Bing Maps and you want to replace it with Google Maps, then you can simply open up the notepad and drag the Maps icon into the notepad and then change the URL to Google dot com slash maps and then you have to save the file as the URL file and from the drop down select all files give it another name and it should be on your desktop by the here it is let's open it and there's Google Maps. If you have any ideas for the iPad C, I will try to include it in the next version, so let me know and enjoy.